Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Eugene. Welcome to Random World. We're on day 28 of this advent calendar. We've looked at each day. We reviewed them. We talked about them. We are opening and building and reviewing in the same day, in the same video. Whereas for Christmas time, I'm going to build the whole set everything in the same video so it's going to be a lot longer um i think <sighs> building block ones because i'm doing this first so i think the building block ones are probably going to be at least in the upwards around 40 minutes to an hour um depends on how many builds there are if there's 24 days i i, I might actually have some um a halloween av encounter as well like this one for christmas i don't know but I have 31 have encounters I'm going to try to attempt to do. My goal is to have one advent calendar each day, one full advent calendar. You'll see a teaser on Thanksgiving. You'll see a teaser on the building block ones. Typically, I do that on Thanksgiving. And then you might see a teaser on a couple other ones that we might be doing as well. And it'll be out throughout the month of December. So we are looking at day 29. Okay. Uh, just ruin the box because you know. Pop it down. All right. Today we are looking at number eighteen. We're gonna build this, and then we're gonna talk about it right afterwards. Okay, here is today's build. It's a little bit weird. Um, it's like, what hodgepodge um, table do you have? I think it's like a, a outside, it's supposed to be chairs and a table setting. Um, and it's supposed to be just some outdoor um, thing. Here is um, what pieces that builds for this final build, which is gonna be really chaotic. I'm gonna build it in a few days, but... Um, it's interesting. I don't. I don't know what this is going to make. I have to put all the papers together and and figure out what the hell I'm going to build. Um, so right now, here is um, the final build on this one. This is supposed to be chairs, you know, like like these type of uh, skeleton chairs. It reminds me of. And then you have a skeleton head, like a pumpkin head. You get two green um, cups, which I actually really do like. I like the green cups. You do get a bat, and you get a couple dark green um, pieces here. And you get these see-through um, reds. You get four of those. The build itself was pretty easy to put together um so i think a child will be easily put this one together i just think that um is it gonna be playful like a child gonna play with this one no are you going to put this in your playscape no i think you're gonna just tear this one apart um the chairs itself can't fit a minifigure and um you do get these three pieces right here are pretty cool i really do like that and if you want more of these red uh red see-through like horn type things you can use those as well so they get four of those which is nice and you do get um yourself another bat which is kind of cool too i like the darker greens too for for leaves so it does give you a couple extra unique pieces but i just don't see it as being play um played with with by a child or I don't see it also being put in a playscape. This is just my thoughts. This one's probably just needs to be destroyed and built into whatever we're going to build it into. And I'm not, I'm not mad about that. Um, what are your thoughts? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.